Wow, oh wow. Datto is crying. As to cross is lost for words for a change, and Bife is definitely scrambling for the law book that probably doesn't exist because my oh my did the final shape reveal just absolutely blow everyone's minds. Now, it was too good not to cover. This isn't going to be a long breakdown video. I'm not going to waste anyone's time or anything like that. Literally, just want to run through the finer details, put some gameplay up of, of just the madness that we just saw. And basically, I want, I want you all to sound off down below in the comments and just let me know what you think. Bungie's back, man. Like, Destiny 2, like, wow. What, what 30 minutes of footage did I just watch? I mean, I was dead set that we were going to see a new subclass and technically not wrong, but the transcendent subclass that they've just actually announced is just absolutely bonkers. Now, even if you've not played Destiny for a while or if you are hardcore and play it nearly every single day, then this thing is going to absolutely blow your mind because basically it is a combination of literally every single skill, every single ability, whether dark subclass, light subclass or whatever, on your hunter, on your titan, on your warlock, Pick your favourite things, mash them all together, build up a little meter that combines your light and your dark powers, and then basically go to Pound Town with them souped up abilities, sending out stasis shurikens, sending out void grenades, doing strand grapples, like just absolute madness. Just, I, I've never seen anything before and just the fact that combining all these skills and abilities is just going to be absolutely bonkers. But if that wasn't enough, and on top of an already bonkers subclass, we're going to be getting finally, we're going to be finally getting back exotic class items. Now, these were something that were long requested and were quite popular in Destiny 1, but they've actually been turned up to the max because these exotic class items for your Warlock, Titan and Hunter will actually allow you to combine exotic traits from other exotic pieces of armor and combine them together to make essentially your own exotic. I mean, it's just absolutely mad and I don't know if they mentioned it, I was too busy freaking out, but on top of that, you can probably use another exotic, so use an exotic helmet like Nezarak Sin to get loads of void abilities back, and then combine two other exotics in your class item. Just absolutely mad. And then finally, the final, I don't know, just absolute madness reveal. Long requested since probably Day Dot of Destiny back 10 years ago. A new enemy type, the Dread. Now, these are obviously based on the Tormentors and stuff that we've been seeing in the past few years, but they've actually been fully fleshed out. New abilities, a flying enemy, just absolute bonkers, absolute crazy stuff. I'm going to try and do a super cut behind all this. And like I say, I wanted to keep it short and sweet, so we're pushing on about three minutes at this point. But let me know. Sound off down in the comments. Destiny's back, man. Like, that just absolutely blew my mind. Into the Light is just here as well, so we've got loads of stuff to do. It's just absolutely crazy. So, thank you very much, everyone, and I'll see you in the next one.